So I was asked by a couple of students when working on your scientific paper how to actually insert special symbols into your Word document. So um, what you'll remember is that you have a temperature exercise where you're measuring things in degrees Celsius and then also just commonly you are talking about amounts of milliliters or microliters that you need to enter and we could just use U if we wanted to for microliters or we could just put C next to the amount in temperature but if you really want your paper to be accurate and, and well done then you're going to want to insert the degree symbol here and you're going to want to actually use the Greek symbol mu for micro so I'm going to show you how to do that now so I'm currently working in Excel 2011 on a Mac but um, these procedures or techniques might be slightly different if you're using 2008 or 2004. So if you're using 2008 or 2004 to insert the degree symbol, what you're going to do is you're going to go to insert, you're going to go to symbol, and if you're given the option of symbol browser in advance, go ahead and start with symbol browser. This will give you the most common symbols that you're likely to find and use. So here you can see we've got our degree symbol. So if I click here, right next to my 40, and then I click the degree symbol, it inserts it, and I now have 40 degrees Celsius. Okay. Now let's say that I want to, instead of using U here for micro, I want to use the actual symbol mu. So I'm going to go in here again, I'm going to scroll down, and here is my Greek alphabet. <clears throat> These are the capital letters, and then here we have the lowercase letters, and there's mu. So again, I'll click, and there's my microliters. So it's as easy as that. And if you're working in 2011, instead of going to insert and symbol, then you can just click here, which is the media browser. And that's going to give you your options to insert that symbol there. Okay, So that's all there is to it on a Mac.